Hi, I'm Emma. Welcome to the True of Calm 5 day, 5 minute wake up to yoga challenge. Today we will be stretching out the legs. So start sitting with your legs crossed. Take hold of your right leg and we're going to rock the hip joint. Loosen up the joint in preparation for our stretch. If you want to take this deeper, tuck the foot into your elbow and an arm around the knee, draw the leg into your chest. Now we're going to take hold of the foot for our next stretch and push into the hands. So you're lengthening and pushing away. Remember to work within your limit. So flexibility comes with practice and it's important to listen to where your body is at today. Bringing the leg down, tucking the other foot into the thigh, reach across the body, so either take hold of the knee, the ankle or the foot, whatever is accessible for you today. Taking a deep breath, lengthen the spine and as you exhale, fold forwards. Look at your toes to help you keep the spine as straight as you possibly can. And coming back, we're going to take the other leg. So start with the foot, we'll go deeper, rocking out the hip. And taking hold of your foot, stretching it up and out. Let's bring that leg down and reach across the body. Bring your other hand behind you, lengthen the spine, reach as far forward as works for you today and take some deep breaths here. Coming back on an exhale. We're going to come into a downward dog now. So bring your hands to the mat, shoulder width apart, feet hip width apart, walk your feet back. And we're going to reach one heel to the ground, bend the opposite leg and swap. So your heels don't need to reach the ground here. If they reach the mat too easy, take a step back. If you're finding this difficult, take a step forwards. You want to feel a really deep calf muscle stretch here. Next, we're going to take the right leg up, point the toes, draw the knee in towards the chest, and up. Exhale forwards one more time. Inhale up, exhale forwards. We're going to drop that foot between the hands. If it needs a helping hand, just place it in between the hands. Line up your knee and your ankle joint. Very important to protect the knee here. Lengthen the back leg, looking forwards, sinking the hips a little. And then hop the back leg halfway forwards. Take hold of the back of the leg, lengthening. Sliding the hands down as far as they will go for you today. Always listening to your body and what it needs. Coming back to down the dog, walk it out. Let's straighten up the left leg. Draw it in. Inhale up. Exhale forwards. Last time, inhale up. Exhale, bring the foot between the hands, lengthen the back leg, line up the knee and the ankle, take some deep breaths, sinking the hips. Then hop that back leg halfway, hold the back of the leg, lengthen the spine and slide the hands down if you can. Come back to a downward dog, walk it out. 
Imagine you're running in slow motion here. Come up on the toes as high as you can, lifting the hips, lengthening the spine, down on the knees. Let's tuck the toes under, interlace your hands behind you, palms together, tuck the chin. Deep breath into the belly. Thank you for practicing with me today. Namaste.